Hello, Jonathan here, Prince of the Interwebs. Behind me, you can see the turnstiles where people will pick up stuff. But that's not what we're doing right now. We are about to leave the airport. Um, I just stayed at the Tim Hortons because I wasn't sure if Izzy was gonna be able to catch her flight. So I figured, you know, I'm gonna stay here just in case. Um, and uh, she made it. But um, by the time I found out she was on the plane, I'd already started uploading um, yesterday's daily vlog. Um, which I finished like an hour ago and I was like, you know, no, I'm just gonna stay here while this uploads and uh, I got a bunch of stuff done in the meantime. My entire day is planned, I just have to do it and I am super pumped. Apparently I should just never sleep. Oddly enough, it actually takes longer to get to my apartment at a regular hour than it would at 6 a.m. How does that make sense? I don't know. And now we're leaving the airport. So the bus behind me is called the 747 because they decided to be clever and name it just like the Boeing. You would know this if you follow me on Twitter. So the plan is get home, shower, and then go do my groceries and come back and have that done in the next two hours. Can I do it? Let's find out. It's just occurred to me that I don't have a channel for random shit anymore. And I'm not sure how I feel about that. Like, as you guys know, this one used to be just for all the videos that didn't work on my main channel. But now it's become the daily vlog. I don't know, I almost feel like I should make another one just for that. And this card thinks that I'm not paying attention, but I am. Cars think now, apparently. I mean, I'm not really feeling the need to do that right now, but what if I do? I am at the college now. And I think I'm going to visit um, the people at the VCSA. Yeah, I'm going to do that right now. Now we're at the newspaper. This is... Oh, wait. Is Has there been any follow through? I don't know. Are you guys all confused in this vlog? I don't know. Are the people in this room confused? Probably. They're playing Spore. I'm at the apartment now, and I got mail from the government. <laughs> ah! Essentially, it was very scary mail. Except it was a mistake. Thank goodness it was a mistake um, because it said that I needed to start paying back my student loans next month. But this, of course, is not true. This is not true at all um, because they thought that I finished studying in September, specifically September 30th, which is kind of a random day considering that's not even when a semester ends. I forgot to send them something. Something that I was never told existed, so of course I didn't send it to them. And the weird thing is, when I had them check, like, everything in their system, they're like, Oh yeah, we know all this, but you have to send it to us. Like, if you don't apply again for loans and bursaries one semester, and you don't tell them that you don't want them, but you're still studying, they're going to assume that you're done studying. Despite the fact that they know that you're still... I don't understand. It's this huge bureaucratic thing where they think they're saving time and being so efficient by asking you to do stuff for them, but it's information they already have. So it's like, um, you're actually wasting lots of time. The other thing that's kind of alarming is that I got this now, a month and a half from when they wanted me to start paying back loans. To me, that's just like a letter from the government basically saying, hello, you have a month to go without paying loans. We could have told you this five months ago. We knew about this five months ago. But here's this thing a month before. Like, huh? Do they want the money for their loans or do they want people to go bankrupt? Because this seems like a good way to get people to go bankrupt. So anyway, the girl on the phone was really nice and I uh, asked her to just leave a suggestion that they send this thing the moment that you are done school. Not six, not five months later, um, because there's a six month grace period where you don't have to pay anything, and blah, 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 boring financial stuff. Let's skip to fun vlog. Let's go grocery shopping. Ah! I didn't go to the grocery store yet. I went to brush my teeth, and then I realized that my skin was ridiculously dry. Like right around here, and here, and right around the scalp, and like just everywhere. And I'm like, Oh God, this is totally stress induced. So I won't just be getting groceries, I'll also be getting something to moisturize skin. I feel like Cassandra from Doctor Who. 
Moisturize me, bitch. Okay, I am off to the grocery store. Um, that's a thing. Great, it's almost three o'clock. Oops. And we are at the grocery store. I can't actually see what the screen is seeing. The screen doesn't see anything. That made no grammatical sense or real life sense, but that's okay because we are gonna get some food now. I haven't slept, remember? I don't even remember if I explained why I didn't sleep. Um, but that's okay, if I didn't, just let me know and I will. What do you call someone who steals lots of lettuce? An ice burglar. People are looking at me after making that terrible pun that I have to escape. Guys, I am so tempted to get this. This, um, it's smoked salmon and it's $10 for that huge, I think this is 600 grams or something. I'm not entirely sure. Anyway, it's a lot. The thing is I don't need nearly as much, but it would make some amazing sushi. Ah. Okay, I think I'm getting it. Yeah, fuck it. This is gonna be the week where Jonathan treats himself to amazing food. I'm beginning to realize that today's vlog is either gonna be amazing or the worst thing that's ever happened on this channel. I decided that I'm going to be making sushi for supper. I, I feel like the quality of the fish will diminish. So I'm like, you know what, I'll just eat it tonight. I didn't have anything planned for supper. Now I do. As you can see here, I have carrots and breadcrumbs prepared. These are, this is actually oatmeal and whole grain flour. And th these are gonna be really simple sushis. But the fact remains, my favorite ones are the just breadcrumbs and fish, and, and sometimes even just breadcrumbs. I'm okay with that. It's the recipe for this weird looking stuff that tastes like, it, it tastes like deep fried food. That's what it tastes like. Anyway, you just take some oatmeal um, and you take some whole grain flour and you take some salt and you take any kind of oil, although I use sunflower oil. That's because that's the oil I had. And then you fry it. But you don't put too much oil, otherwise it's like greasy and ew. I'll stay awake. Cause the doc's not taking prisoners tonight. Apparently tonight is a sushi and 21 pilots night. Tonight's a good night. You are watching Jonathan Without Sleep. The new series on NBC. So this is the salmon, the little pieces of smoked salmon, and this is a huge piece that I am gonna put into my mouth. Mm. To show you, holy shit, that's delicious. So what you do, you just take one of these pieces of nori, uh, which is seaweed, and you put a bunch of rice in the middle, um, and you don't quite touch the edges, and then you just put your fish or whatever, carrots, or I'm probably not even gonna use the carrots. And you make rolls with the rolling mat, and then you cut them, and then you take them, and you put them in your mouth. Mmm. Guess why I'm smiling. So remember that date? Um, well, the date has been set, um, later this week, for later this week, and, um, let's just say getting some validation from unexpected places is nice, because I just got, I, I don't even know if it's called, if you can call it a compliment, but it kind of is, that just blows my mind in to a million pieces and ah, you're doing it right but you're not watching this so that's okay i can say this he hasn't actually watched my videos but the reason he gave is just amazing and um I would share it, but I don't feel like it. Um, yeah. But it's it's great. It just made me realize just a, a little bit of something about me anyway. Um, also, 
This flower. It's a plant. It's not a flower, you stupid. It's wilting. I need to water my plants. I am filming, filming, filming a video thing for you. Why did I have it? Why did, I, why did that have to be Taylor Swiftized? I don't know. The camera is up here and um, it's precarious and this video is really weird. It's not taking the turn I expected it to, but <laughs> it's fun. Now it's time for commenting on comments. This video doesn't have very many comments, but it has more likes than usual. Thank you, Rihanna, for not calling me a dumb shit. Um, sometimes I am way more self-deprecating than I should be. That's a thing. That's definitely a thing. I should work on that. Anyway, thank you. This has been a great day. Um, I got a little distracted towards the middle of it. Which is not surprising considering the low levels of sleep. But if I can keep these levels of motivation up, um, and combine that with actual rest, I can do anything. You can do anything too. Imagine the possibility. Anyway, I'm gonna end this now because I have a feeling it's going it's gonna be quite long. Bye.